Hello Amiga fans, this is the second of my videos demonstrating some of the old Amiga technologies that we used back in the day. Uh, we're not using an old Amiga here, this is the newer generation of Amiga, this is a 600. It's still pretty old by today's standards. But the piece of software I'm going to be demonstrating today is the Director, published by the Right Answers Group. Um, the author credited here on the manual is Keith Doyle. I think there were other programmers involved, but uh, the Right Answers Group created a professional display and animation language for the Amiga and was published in 1987. Now, this was the tool we had to kind of put animations together, create interactive uh, presentations uh, before we had all the power of Deluxe Paint 3 and Deluxe Paint 4. Um, you could create animations and trigger them uh, with your mouse. In this demonstration, we're going to use the newer sound mod, which is now the MIDI mod, to display graphics from a note on event on channel 1 into a MIDI interface in the back. Uh, and we're going to also hear uh, feedback sounds that are loaded. Uh, so. With no further ado, hope this works. This is the director from the Right Answers Group. I changed their demos graphics with some more modern web graphics. So here we go. Now that's a page flipping animation. There's also a demonstration of some of the draw commands and color cycling uh, that I'll load up for you. So let me load that up and I'll be right back. Okay, here we go with the second of the MIDI mod demonstrations from for the director uh, from the Right Answers group. This one uses some uh, drawing tools, color cycling tools. The samples you'll hear if you listen closely will respond to pitch information. Um, the director was written on purpose in a syntax that was very similar to BASIC. So if, even if you had a rudimentary understanding of BASIC programming and a rudimentary understanding of the Amiga, you could put yourself uh, in a good situation to make presentations uh, and, and animations with it. It was a very good manual as I remember. As you can see I've just about worn it out. But uh, here is a, like the second demo. We're going to see some drawing tools and the notes sit on the stack. And then we'll get pretty low there. pretty interactive. Um, it was a different time. This machine was used to create graphics to be laid over analog video using tape. Um, we didn't have the internet. We, we didn't have a lot of the things you just take for granted nowadays. Um, and this machine was so far ahead of its time that in making these tools available to the common user, uh, it invented the future that we're living in now. Uh, parallel graphics processing, multiple channel sound, um, you know, the list goes on and on. It's an amazing machine, so enjoy your Amiga.